Sunday reset. Now it is Monday today but all of yesterday I literally just edited the video that went live for you last week so I didn't get a chance to do my Sunday reset and I really want to show you because I feel like between Lyle and I we've got the reset down to a T but he is actually away to Singapore for two weeks so I am doing it solo today and I will show you everything I get up to. I am starting in the car once again because we are going to head and do a food shop this morning. I like just getting it done like first thing in the morning when it's not too busy. Also with it being Monday I feel like it's going to be a good quiet shopping experience and it's currently half eight so I woke up nice and early, got ready and we're ready to go. If you enjoy this kind of content make sure to go down below, hit the subscribe button, do all the nice stuff. Also we hit 30,000 subscribers last night. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Welcome to everyone you here. I am so excited. Anyway, let's go and get a food shop. I'm speeding through this intro because it is so hot in this car. <laughs> Successful, but I am going to pop over to Sainsbury's just to pick up any other bits that I couldn't get in Aldi and then we can head home. It's already so hot, like, I really want to try and do this reset before like peak heat. <laughs> I'm just gonna give you like a really quick rundown. Firstly, I just got some wraps for like breakfast wraps, some sourdough bread. I love these yogurts from Aldi. They're so yummy. They're like cherry and strawberry flavor, but I think they have another couple of flavors as well. I just got some plain yogurt, cereal, some sweet corn for my dinner tonight. I also got eggs, some chicken. Sorry if like raw chicken grosses you out. Um, cucumber, onions, some milk and some sparkling water. I'm going to make a element drink with this. I'm so excited. And I just got some blueberries, apricots, grapes, parsley, avocado, some spring onion, some leaves for my salads. There's some basil in there, strawberries. And then I got these again for my breakfast wraps, which look so good. They're like chicken chocolates, like little sausages. I got a pepper, two types of tomatoes on a vine and just like baby plum tomatoes, peppers, dill, a watermelon. I swear I've been like devouring a watermelon every single week. And I got some extra virgin olive oil. I got some pasta for a pasta salad that I'm going to make, some sunflower tomato paste, chipotle sauce. I got some of these in a cucumber and mint and lime flavour, which I'm excited to have. I think they're like so refreshing. I got some snacks in case I get peckish. These are the cherry bakewell Gray's snacks, they're so good. And I also got a top up of surface cleaner because we've run out. And that is everything in my grocery haul. restock is all done and I feel like it looks so good. It's now house reset time and I'm going to try and challenge myself to do this within an hour and a half. I don't know if that's reasonable but to be fair the flat is fairly tidy. I literally just need to do all the cleaning so like the surfaces, dusting, floors, I want to strip the bed, do a wash, that kind of thing. It's currently 10.01 so let's see how we get on. So as you saw, this is the surface cleaner I just bought and it's in an apple blossom scent. So I'm excited to try this. And my go-to window and glass cleaner is this one, which is actually just like Sainsbury's own brand, but I feel like it cleans really well. So those are the things I'm going to be using.
we're about 40 minutes in and I feel like we're doing so well with our reset so far. We're actually on to the final room which is my bedroom and I'm about to strip the bed, put new bedding on but I do think this room might take me a little bit longer because I have this massive pile of clothes that are all clean and have basically just accumulated over the past couple of weeks and I've kind of been like digging through them to find clean clothes and it's about time I put them away. This is the pile in question. <laughs> actually not going to put clean bedding on right now because I bought this fitted sheet from Primark alongside these pillowcases and I really want to wash them and use them today so that's what I'm going to do first and then we can do the bed later. I'm now just going to time lapse me putting all of these clothes away, which I think will be quite therapeutic to watch. I am in desperate need of like a wardrobe declutter but I actually want to do like a whole wardrobe reset because I'm kind of really over like having curtains as wardrobe doors and I really just want to go to Ikea and get some cute doors. I also think we should get another wardrobe so then we can like make this whole wall a wardrobe wall um, and that way Lyle and I can have our separate wardrobes because I feel like it's just not working. Like I feel like there's just too many clothes and I find it really difficult to find clothes in this wardrobe so that could be something we might do very very soon so stay tuned for that. cleaner we use which I've just realized is from the same brand and the same scent as the surface cleaner I bought earlier. We mix this with a little bit of water in the actual mop. I'm actually going to put like a fresh end on the mop. This one looks dirty but I have washed it so it is nice and clean. flat smells like during the summer we go for this seashells scent from the white company and this is like an oil and we have this little diffuser from the white company as well and you basically just drop a couple of drops in there and that makes the whole flat smell insane flat reset is done the house smells amazing and it looks so clean i'm super super happy that took just under two hours but i still need to like obviously hang up the wash and like put fresh bedding on once it's dry so that's a like later on in the day kind of task but for now i actually didn't realize but i have a deadline very very soon so i need to bash on with a tiny little bit of work up on my work as you saw hung up my washing as well and I've just popped on some shorts because 
because I am so warm. Like it's roasting, I love it, it's amazing, but this flat gets a lot of sun and it does mean like it just becomes so, so hot. And it doesn't help that I've preheated the oven because I've just popped my chicken sausages in for my wraps. And I think I'm going to do wraps, tomatoes, and some like mixed leaf salad and maybe some cucumber as well. And I've also got a little drink because I need to try and cool down. I'm really trying to like up my protein intake. I feel like ever since growing up, I'm just not the biggest meat eater. Like I'm very much veggies, fruit, and I'm trying to like get a lot of protein within my diet. So I basically bought some chicken sausages and I bought some chicken billet. So I'm really hoping that will kind of help boost my protein intake because I do feel great when I have protein and like high protein weeks. I feel like I have a lot more energy, which is always great. So that's kind of what I'm trying to do. from my smear test which I had done about I want to say two weeks ago and I was actually really nervous to open the letter like I think I was more nervous to open the letter than I was to go and get the like exam done because obviously the letter like contains the results but I just opened it and luckily everything is all good which does mean that I basically need to go back in three years to do my next smear test but I wanted to film this because I wanted to just remind you if you've been putting it off or if you have like completely forgotten about it this is your reminder go and get your smear test booked it is literally over within a few minutes it doesn't hurt as long as you're like fully relaxed and the nurses that kind of like take you through the process are so lovely they talk you through everything and honestly yeah as I said it's over so quickly so I highly recommend going to get it done because it's always better to like have any concerns addressed nice and early on but anyway that's my little reminder for you if you've been putting it off go and get your smear done. Lyle got me these flowers before he left for Singapore because he's literally going to be away for like two weeks and he got me snacks and he got me flowers and I was like babe you know me so well. So yeah these are so pretty like they've just opened up and honestly I'm completely obsessed with them and they just remind me of him which is so nice. I am now thinking about going around the flat and I'm watering all the plants because I imagine they're also very thirsty.
just finished the weekly reset by making my bed. As you saw, I just popped some clean bedding on and also the sheets that I washed earlier dried so quickly. So that was really, really handy and I popped them on and everything smells amazing and I'm so excited to get in it later on. But for now, I think I'm going to end the video here. I wanted to say thank you so, so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this little weekly reset vlog. And if you did, make sure to go down below and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any future content just like this. And I will see you very, very soon with a brand new video. Bye!